If you are facing any storm in life, this is the promise God spoke to you. Focus on this. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will remain secure and rest in the shadow of the Almighty, whose power no enemy can withstand. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust, with great confidence and on whom I rely. For he will save you from the trap of the fowler, the enemy's false accusation, and from the deadly pestilence curse. He will cover you and completely protect you with his outer feathers, and under his wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness is a shield and a wall. You will not worry in fear or be afraid of the terror of the demonic forces at night nor of the error that flies by day. Don't fear a thing, whether by night or by day. Demonic danger will not trouble you, nor will the powers of evil launched against you. Even in a time of disaster, if thousands fall and are killed, you will remain unscathed and unharmed. Danger will not come near you. You will be a spectator as the wicked perish in judgment, for they will be paid back for what they have done. Because you have made the Lord your refuge, even the Most High, your hiding, dwelling place, you will always be shielded from harm. No evil will befall you nor any diseased plague come near your hiding place to infect you. God commands his angels with special orders to protect you wherever you go, to guard you in all your ways of obedience and service, defending you from all harm. God's angels will lift you up in their hands so that you do not even strike your foot against a stone. If you walk into a trap, they'll be there for you and keep you from stumbling. You'll even walk unharmed among the fiercest powers of darkness, trampling every one of them beneath your feet. Because you set your love to delight on me, therefore I will greatly protect you to save you. I will set you securely on high before my face because you know my name. You confidently trust and rely on me, knowing I will never abandon you. No, never. I will answer your cry for help every time you pray, and you will find and feel my presence even in your time of pressure and trouble. I will rescue you and honor you. I will be your glorious hero and give you a feast. You will be satisfied with a full life and with all that I do for you, for you will enjoy the fullness of my salvation. Psalms 91. Amen. Praise the Lord. Please share this with those who are facing storms in life.